Yo, what's up there, guys? Dr. Phil Hahn. Today is episode 5 of NHL 14 Be a Gem with the Boston Bruins. And also, it is part 1 of our playoff marathon. And if you do not know what the playoff marathon is, it's that is you guys could get basically up to 4 videos straight. So, one every single day. One round equals one video. So, do the math yourself. So today we're going to do round one, and our round one is last year's first round playoff match, the Boston Bruins versus the Toronto Maple Leafs, and this is when Toronto, all-time high for their chokingness. Oh, it was a great, great, great series. Oh, man, it was great. I loved seeing Toronto just choke at the end. Oh, it was tremendous, but whatever. That was last year. Now this year, they didn't make the playoffs, so they're pretty terrible. So before we're going to start a playoff marathon, or before we start the first round, we're going to do our lines. To be honest, the lines are actually good. Um, I don't really have anything to say about our lines. Uh, it was good. It was on and off. But other than that, our power play was much better than it was before. And our penalty kill also was much better. So I think I'm going to keep it at that. And maybe we can... Uh, I, would like, I would love to get Tory Krug on our team. Because he's got that offensive, like, shooting category that I like. And he probably, like, McQuaid's the guy that I don't, like, I, like, I'm not saying I don't like him. It's just he's too much, like, he has no discipline whatsoever. And you'll see in the penalty minutes. You saw in the penalty minutes. But for now, uh, we're going to leave our lines. If anything goes wrong, then we'll switch them up right away. But other than that, we will keep it the same. And yes, for my power play, okay, yes sir. A penalty kill, okay. Uh, I don't know why the hell Chris Kelly, no. That was a power play, no, no, okay. Chris Kelly's there, okay. And yes sir, yes sir, yes sir. And then we make sure our Rask is in net, okay. So, let's start this baby up. First day, we're going to put injuries on because that's how we do it. And I turn the injuries off when the season actually starts. And when the playoff hits, we turn them off because we want to make it lifestyle or, like, realistic. I don't turn them on because this injury thing is, like, way, way, way pushing it. So, where is injuries? Did I skip it? Did I skip it? Yes. Okay. On. Okay. So, let's start it up. Uh, so, I just want to go check my HL team first. Uh, they made the playoffs. They still have two more games left, so let's start this baby up. First game, and we are away, but that doesn't matter for the Boston Bruins. They are so much better. So let's sim game, and let's see if they're actually good. So let's do this. Uh, okay, so first period. Oh, fuck off. Really? Already a goal? Like, come on there, buddy. Rask, wake up. Defense, wake up. So let's go what? First period. All right, team. We got Erickson. Fucking Mason Raymond and... Oh, what the hell is wrong with you guys? Come on. Shots are equal. What do we have? No defense? Oh, come on, guys. Wake up. Second period. Oh, ooh, there we go. Okay. A little comeback right there. But we got that friggin... Toronto still scored. The shots are still equal. But Lucic, Setaguchi, and Bergeron decided to actually show up and score us some goals. I think it's Rask. At the end of the day, I think it's just Rask. That's just pretty much starting to suck. But we gotta wake the fuck up, man. Let's go there, guys. Come on, there we go. Set of Gucci. There we go. Picked him up from Winnipeg, and now he's doing something for us. Even though he's on the oh, fuck off. Come on, really, Kudri? You suck, you guys. Come on, guys. Come on, wake up. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's the fourth liner right there. Gregory Campbell scored. Are you kidding me? A fourth liner scores. Where's the Where's the people on our first line? Like, where the hell have they been? Like, all Toronto players also? Guys, wake up, man. Was it Homestat? No, wait. Kelly, Smith, Paye, McQuay, Lucy, Seidenberg, Rutowski, Bergeron. Come on. Wake up there, guys. That was risky right there, but, like, come on. Wake up, first line. Please, no injuries. Come on there. There we go. No injuries. And also, I forgot to actually check. The, um, uh, their lines. So we're just gonna go check their lines. But guys, man, what the hell is wrong with them? They can't even win against. They can. They can barely win against the Toronto. I wonder what they do against a freaking stronger team. So Toronto Maple Leafs. Let's see what they have. Uh, Lupo, Kadri, Kessel. Good line. 
uh, second line, Reams Dyke, uh, Tyler Bozak, and uh, Kuleman. Pretty good second line. And then Mason Raymond, Speedy Raymond right there. Bolin and Clarkson, good third line and fourth line. Ah, they got Paul Rangers, so I'm guessing they have injuries. Uh, Defensive-wise, they're pretty terrible as it is in real life, but I'm pretty sure what keeps them in is their goalies, Bernie and Reimer. Because our goalie cannot keep us in whatsoever. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a second, see if uh, Tuka Rask can do a little bit better. And if he can't, then Markstrom's going in because it's terrible. So let's do this. Second game away. Oh, my God. Come on. Really? Guys. No. Okay. First period. There. What the fuck, guys? Come on. Rask. What's our defense? I don't want to blame Rask, but, like, come on, man. Wake up, Rask. You're terrible. Let's go, man. Second period. Really? 3-0. Three 3-0. Nothing. Three nothing. Guys. What is this? Come on there, guys. Oh, what the hell? Rask. Again? Man, oh, man. Rask, you're getting out. And I'm going to have to change some lines because this isn't doing good whatsoever. Yeah, oh, my God. You guys are terrible. This is the this is an embarrassment. This is embarrassment for Boston. Like, you're losing against freaking... Oh, wait. You're losing against... Wait, how is that possible when we did... There was four goals. Ah! So I'm guessing it was only most of us. It was the penalty kill. So that penalty kill is bad. Yeah, that penalty kill is bad, I can say. But Rask isn't doing that good also. I can tell that right now. Rask is not uh, shining right now. I'm not. I want to. I don't want to blame him, but he's got to wake the frig up. Also, our players need to wake up. Because this is an embarrassment. And I don't know what direction they're going on. But we got to change it up. Okay, penalty kill. Bergeron, Lucic, I like it. But Kelly, Marchand, uh, Krejci? I don't want to Krejci. I like Marchand because of his body. But Krejci has the better... I think he has the better defensive awareness. Where is Marchand? I think he has a better defensive awareness. Yeah, he's got the better defensive awareness. But he's terrible for body. Uh, what I'm going to do is... McQuaid's have a good defensive awareness. You know what? I think McQuaid, he needs to get off our team. He really needs to. You know what? McQuaid, we'll scratch McQuaid. I think that's the best move for us right, right now. I right, see if that see if that's actually working because uh, we'll bring in uh, Tory Krug. See if that actually works out. And if it doesn't, then whatever. But he's getting way too many penalties and it's really pissing us off. So penalty kill, uh, we'll put two. Us uh, has a good defensive awareness. Has a Dougie. Does a Dougie have a good defensive awareness? 87. So I'm pretty sure he needs to go in penalty kill. Dougie right there, and then we should be good. Third man penalty kill. Three man penalty kill. Uh, where's Dougie? Uh, Dougie Hamilton. Where are you there, buddy? He can't be. He is right there. Dougie Hamilton. Ooh, jumps up to 83. That's good for him. Uh, four and four lines, and then we will go with Dougie. Where are you, Dougie? Right there, and then Bartowski, Dougie, more like Krug. Uh, Toy Krug, Toy Krug, you're right there. There you go. So we'll scratch out McQuaid. See, um, he's the guy that usually gets a lot of penalties, but maybe it's not him. But I just want to see because we're getting way too many penalties. Our penalty, our Penalty kill sucks, but we'll try Corey, uh, Toy Krug. We'll see what it does. But for now, I'm giving Rask one more chance. If he can't produce, then we're going to have to change some stuff up. And we're going to have to put Markstrom in. So let's let's see if this works. Home ice advantage. Come on there, guys. First period, nothing. We have more shots. So come on there, guys. Second period, there we go. Sean Thorne, Patrice Bergeron, Daniel Paye. Shot Thorne, fourth liner. Patrice Bergeron, first liner. And Daniel Paye, third liner. No second line, no first line whatsoever. Wow. Way to go, man. Our first line, second line aren't doing that good. But let's see if they can actually keep it together. Oh, there we go. Ooh, power play. There we go. Patrice Bergeron, another goal by him. Okay, come on there, guys. Come on there, guys. Come on. Here you go, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And we won. There we go. Okay. 
So the problem is that we suck on the penalty kill. And we're better in home ice. We're better on home ice. So if you go three stars, uh, yep. Choose Bergeron, Tuka Rask, and Dennis Seidenberg. Okay, so if we go home stats, it's plus minus. No one's a minus. And okay, so we're good. I think we just can't get any penalties. And I think Adam McQuaid will be good if we just take him out and maybe trade him next season because I don't need it, need him. And uh, he was taking up a lot of penalty minutes. And right now it's Gregory Campbell, but I don't. It doesn't matter. I just. Adam Quaid needs to probably sit out. And I think Toy Krug's much better than, uh, than uh, Adam Quaid. So. But right now, what? Oh, is it, uh, where's edit lines? I'm going to go check who has the better whatever. Like uh, defensive awareness and all that. Uh, if I go defense, if I go Corey, Toy Krug. Uh, he's got 80 defensive awareness. His body is not that good. Skating, pretty good. Shooting, pretty good. And other than that, he's okay. And I think Adam McQuaid has the same defensive awareness, if I'm not mistaken. No, he's got higher defensive awareness. But other than that, yeah. Okay, I think I use Tory Krug. Have only two defensive defensemen. And we'll see where it goes from there. But that game proved it right there. If we don't take any penalties, we can win a game pretty good. So... Okay, second home ice advantage, uh, fourth game. So let's see if Boston can actually uh, win the series within five games. So let's go do this. First period. Ooh, okay, Dion Phaneuf, even strength goal, but it was late in the period. So um, not much to say. We just got to wake up. So uh, let's go first line, second line, uh, second period. Ooh, voice crack, but still. Uh, Patrice Bergeron, and why is Mark Savard there? Why the hell is Mark Savard there? This only means one thing. Someone's injured or for some reason, Mark Savard decided to show up on the ice. But what the frig, man? He's still got a goal also. So let's continue with this. Let's see if we can actually win this game. Third period. Uh, we have the... We have, oh, fuck off. Really? Kadri? Come on there, guys. Wake up. Guys. Bergeron. Say Gucci. Smith? No. Okay. Something freaked up. We just cannot win it for some reason. Uh, three stars. Uh, all Toronto crappy players. Uh, somebody's injured because Mark Savard decided to show up. Uh, was I right or wrong? Or he decided just... No, no one's injured. He decided just to show up. Wait, What? When did I not? I didn't see that. I did not see Erickson getting hurt. Are you kidding me? That's why. I didn't see. When did it tell me that Setaguchi was hurt? Oh, uh, you know why? Because, um, um, I know why. I know why. Uh, settings, uh, I think coach is coaching setting on, on minimal. I think assistant coach. There we go. I need it off. Oh, that's why. That's why I didn't see him. Damn it. That's why we lost Erickson. Top player Erickson. That is right. Damn it. That's probably why. Ah, come on. Why do I not hear these things? This is why EA. This is why Gem Mode is just completely. Ah, oh, it's broken. It's just completely broken right now. Erickson. And then, where's Savard? Savard, you're getting scratched. Uh, who's on the power play? Erickson. Oh, wow. He was, uh, Mark Savard was on the power play also. So we're going back to our original. Erickson needs to come back. Needs to score us a hat trick the first game back. But other than that, I think we're fine. I'll just leave it at that right now. Uh, okay, it should be fine. And then shootouts. Doesn't matter who goes there. There it doesn't matter because we have no shootouts. Okay. Game five. Oh, that was game four. Yeah, that was game four. Okay. Game five at Toronto. So let's see if Boston can wake up again. Uh, let's just let's just do this. First period? Ah, come on. Really? Van Riemsdyk? Oh my god. It's a power play goal. You see, when we're on the penalty kill, we suck. I'm gonna have to fix up that penalty kill. I'm really gonna have to fix up that penalty kill. Second period? There we go, Sedeguchi and Krejci. Wow. 
There goes our first line. There goes our second line. Or no, there goes our second line. There we go. Way to go, guys. Thank you. Thank God you guys are actually alive. Okay, let's go. Come on there, guys. Keep the lead. Don't get any penalties. Keep the lead. Don't get any penalties. Score some goals. Nah, come on. No. Guys, come on. Guys, wait. No, what the hell, Lupo? Are you guys kidding me? Come on. Really? Oh, you guys are terrible. You guys are terrible. The simming is terrible. 35 shots on goal, and for some reason, they score on us. Three stars. Oh, come on. This is complete shit right now. This is shit. Guys, wake up. Guys, come on. They're about to eliminate us. And you guys are, are laughing your asses off. Oh, boy, Chuck's injured. Why do I not see these people? Hit in lines manually. Let's go best lines. Why do I why don't I see these people getting injured? Now Adam McQuaid's in our lineup. I don't know why. But that's probably him taking the penalties. I'm not hating on him, but I'm just saying like Okay, penalty kill, penalty kill. Penalty kill, penalty kill, penalty kill. Lucci girl on that second line. Krejci, you're staying on that first line. Kelly and Lucic will be there. And I think I'm going to keep it at that right now. And I'm tempted to switch freaking Ras for Markstrom. I don't... I really don't know. I really do not know, guys. This is... Either it's... it's we suck on the penalty kill. What? We are terrible on the penalty kill. But for some reason, we cannot win. But let's just see if this works. We're going to have to wake up. We're really going to have to wake up. So come on there, guys. First period. Oh, there we go. Okay, someone scored. Who's that? Setaguchi. Star player Setaguchi. Because our line, first line is doing nothing except uh, Patrice Bergeron. I don't see Erickson doing anything. So keep it together, guys. Let's go. Second period. There we go. Where we go? Come on there, guys. Let's lose the lead. Like it's nothing. You guys are laughing your asses off, but it's nothing. Come on there, guys. Wake up. Come on, come on. Don't get any penalties. Don't get any penalties. Come on there, guys. Somebody score on our team. First line. Second line. Oh, my. No, no. This is shit. You guys are terrible. How the hell can you lose against Toronto? Really? How the hell can you lose against Toronto? Oh, my God. Really? The worst playoff series ever. Ever. And what are guys doing? They decide to lose against Toronto. You know what? I'm tempted to trade Rask right now. Like, come on, man. There's only so much you can do. I don't want to blame Rask, but like I'm I'm blaming him because I'm sorry, I'm just I'm really sorry right now. I'm pissed off because he they decided to lose against Toronto. Like, come on, man. Like we need to wake the fuck up and decide to actually play hockey. Four man power play, penalty kill. No, no, no. You guys, you guys, this is an embarrassment to Boston. It's an embarrassment to hockey itself. Losing against the Leafs, that's a big embarrassment. But, I don't know, I can always blame the simulation, but really, they were a close game. It's just, when we take a penalty, we can't, we can't kill the penalty. We're terrible on the penalty kill. I've changed it a lot of times, I've tried to change it. And it still doesn't work. So, leave it at that. Boston needs to wake up. And next year is another year. I'm sorry if I decided if I raged out. But it's just, it's terrible when you see your team losing against Toronto. We'll see who wins the Stanley Cup. I hope it's not Toronto, but you never know. I'll uh, we'll just finish off this video right here. Where's the draft? But, I've, I'm really... I'm really irritated that we lost against Toronto. And it's, uh... I'm not saying it's my fault. Oh, my God. Let's just... Don't care about... Uh, what the fuck. I'm sorry if I swear a lot, but I'm just saying, like, it's an embarrassment, first of all. I was hoping for me to the around ourselves, Boston. But, frankly, your performance was not up to par. I'm not happy with this series result. I'm sorry there, owner. You can... You can blame me all you want, but I've got you good players. I've thought about the future of this team. And also, I've changed the lineups enough to actually people to wake the frig up and actually get a good team. 
But nope. Austin has to lose it in the end. Um, my the owner doesn't. Uh, owner thinks I did bad this year, but actually, I got in players of the future. We had to trade some players. It's just doesn't matter if Boston one doesn't win the cup in the first year or so. But we need to get prospects. And we need to get young players, and we actually need to win the Stanley Cup soon enough because Boston. They're going pretty bad. Okay, injuries galore. Like, it's, there's no tomorrow. That's what I hate the simulation. It's like, if you turn injuries on, you will literally have an injury every single game you play. And some of you guys might be saying, oh, this is real life hockey. I'm like, no. Every single game, someone's not injured in every single game. Most of the time, look at injuries galore, man. Most of the time, it's every couple of games, but not every game somebody's injured. Like, come on, man. Think about it. Like, I know sometime it could get a little bit crazy, but other than that, not every game. Like, look at I'm just... Literally, I keep saying this all the time. This is won't stop, man. This won't stop. Okay. We got to think about the draft. Let's forget about this year. This year was just... Season, we did okay. It wasn't typical Boston, but other than that, playoffs were terrible. I don't know what happened to Boston. Uh, it's just... Something went wrong. Okay, let's get Reinhardt. I'm debating on getting Reinhardt or Ekblad. I think I will get Reinhardt or somebody else that's good. Or that's up there, but... We're gonna have to... Okay, let's go. I don't care anymore. Let's go. Looks like our... Uh, uh, looks like our... Uh, looks like our AHL team's all actually doing good. And Toronto's still in the playoffs, so that's not a good sign. If Toronto wins the cup, then it's like, okay, yeah. It's not, you can't really, it's like, yeah, we did, we put up a fight. But in the end, Toronto decided to win. But if Toronto wins the cup, then it doesn't really look bad on us. But it still looks bad because we lost against Toronto. Uh, whatever. I despise the Leafs, so. I know I've said that a lot of times, I'm just saying that. I despise the Leafs. There you go, I keep seeing injury after injury, like, there's no tomorrow. There we go. Oh my god, that's three games in a row and an injured player has been set. Okay, come on there guys. Ooh, are we are we are we still in? Ooh, we made it to the Ooh, we made it. Ooh, okay, I guess we're gonna have to No 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 No. Continue. No, stop, 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 stop. Okay, ooh, looks like our Providence Bruins are actually they're actually good. Let's just see if okay, we have one win. Yeah, we got one win. So let's see if they can actually. It's actually exciting. It looks like our our rookies are actually doing good. But let's see if they can win it, and it won't look bad on our uh, NHL team, or it won't look that bad on our NHL team. Uh, I'll just go best lines. Everybody's getting injured. Okay, so what are we at? We're two wins to two, two to two in the series. Let's see. If, ooh, three to two. Let's let's check this out. Ooh, maybe they can win it. Yeah, maybe they can win it. Okay, sim it. Oh, let's go, Providence Bruins. Let's go first period. Okay, uh, second period. No, third period. Let's see if they can get it back and win the and win it. Oh, there we go, Cunningham. There we go. Come on. Oh, there we go, Cunningham again. Oh, can we keep it together? Can we keep it together? Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, yes, we won it. We wow, There we go. Cunningham gets the hat trick. Oh, there we go. All because of you, Cunningham. There we go. Star player, Cunningham. Future NHL. -er. Oh, there we go. We won it. We won it. Oh, my God. Cunningham, you are a stud. You are a stud, Cunningham. Love it. Oh, man. I love it. Love it. Love it. Uh, at least our HL team's doing good. That's one thing I can give props to them. Our NHL team needs to really wake up, but years to come, it'll get better. I can tell you that right now. Ooh, Pittsburgh Penguins won the Stanley Cup, and then we got the Providence Bruins also. So, uh, continue. We're going to go all the way to... We're going to do a season wrap-up. Uh, we might go check some scouting. or No, I'll wait till next year to do some scouting, and then we'll actually we'll see what we have to do. But for right now... We'll just go look at some players, and we might go look at 
I want to go look if some player is boosted up. Uh, it's only it's early stage, but still. Uh, I think it's early. It's too early to actually them for boosting. Yeah, Dougie Hamilton boosted. That's good. Uh, Sidiguchi, McQuaid, Riley Smith boosted. Uh, Mark Savard, no. Chris Kelly. And what about uh, Toy Krug? Toy Krug, did he boost? He, no, he didn't. And our prospects, none of them has boosted. What about our goalies? Uh, Rast, Markstrom, no. And uh, Subban, no, also. I really want to trade Subban. I really do to get maybe a prospect. But for now, we'll leave it at that. I think we'll end the video right here. Uh, there's really no point on seeing the stat central. I just want to go check. Uh, no, I want to go NHL. Let's just want to go check our penalty kill. Where's the penalty kill? Power play. Uh, where's our penalty kill? No, wins, loss, goals for, goals against. Uh, power play. Where's our penalty kill? Points, no. Power play and penalty kill. There, go. penalty kill. It's still not that bad, but we just we're terrible. We're terrible on the on the penalty kill. That's the only thing that's bad about Boston right now. But next year is another year. Overall, Boston did okay. Sort of okay in the season. But in the playoffs, they did terrible. But Toronto actually got far for some reason. I don't know why. I could always blame the simulation, but that's just not me. And it looks like Petrangelo won the... Looks like Petrangelo won the... Was it uh, James Norris Memorial Trophy? And we will probably go... We'll go look at the awards right now, so we don't have to do a next episode. Uh, Pittsburgh Penguins won the Stanley Cup. Uh, Providence Bruins won the Calder Cup. Uh, okay, so St. Louis Blues won the President's Trophy. Phoenix Coyotes, okay. Pittsburgh Penguins, Prince of Wales, Art Ross Trophy, Marion Gabrick. Rick Nash won the Hart Memorial. Alex Petrangelo won the James Norris. Uh, Marion Gabrick won the Lady Bing. Brent Braden Holtby won the Calder. Consumite goes to Evgeny Malkin. Vesna. Ver, uh, Simeon Vermalov or uh, Verlamov. Uh, the Jennings Trophy goes to the same one. Brooks Orpik won the Bill Masterson Memorial Trophy. Pavel Dastuk won the Selk, uh, Frank J. Selk's Trophy. Ted Lindsay goes to Rick Nash and Ovechkin, Morris Richard, obviously. Hammer Stamp goes to Tavares. Usually they win it. That's about it. NHL will just go through until we actually get, uh, see if we actually. Yeah, okay, they won with the most points. Uh, ooh, Tatar, okay. Uh, ooh, Seth Griffith. Ooh, Seth Griffith, okay, nice. Two trophies for him. Uh, ooh, S uh, Sevenberg won. Ooh, nice. Okay, wow. Okay, that's good. That's good for them. That's good for our rookies. Future prospects or future players of the NHL. But like I said, overall, we did not that good this year. But next year's another year. We'll do much better. Subject guys, remember please subscribe and we'll see you next time. So bye bye.